What's up guys, Mr. Allen C checking out a military shovel. Let's see how this comes packaged and put it to use. All right, here's the box it came in. And we got a really nice instruction manual with colored pictures. It's like a cool like army backpack. Now that's cool. Man, that's gonna be fun. Also, this must be the shovel itself. So it's got a cover over the top. Then the various heavy metal extensions. So let's go ahead and get this built. What's this? You also get, looks like a military knife. Wow, take a look at this military style knife. That blade is incredible. And there's a pop tap opener on the end. And multiple tools for different uh, nuts and bolts to remove them. If we take a look at the top of the handle, it contains a compass. And then if we unscrew it, and we pull it out, here's what you're going to find. Now you know what that is? That would be flint. So you can take the included knife and scrape away the black protective coating. And you'll be ready to start a fire in no time. All right, I'm going to try something a little more natural like some dry leaves. So that's one piece right there. Now let's see what else we got. This other piece of the handle contains a screwdriver. So you got the Phillips head, got a flat head, then when not in use, it goes into here. Uh, we can go ahead and twist this transformation mechanism and release that, and that releases it. We can see we have a sharp blade on this side for cutting, along with a ruler. We can connect the other pieces of the handle now. And right, and right here is where I was getting that metal hit, so we're going to dig. It's right there. Look how nice it's just cut right through the grass, right through the ground. Remove this piece of dirt, soil. Use a military flashlight to see if we can find a piece of metal. We got it out. It's getting dark fast. All right. So we did find something cool. What did we find? It's like some sort of little necklace or something. I don't know what that is. It's very cool. You can see I just fit the entire shovel easily into the included backpack and I put the protection part on the knife blade and yeah we got a whole front area for a wallet id whatever we want and this is pretty awesome guys